Hello guys, Devjyoti here from www.youtube.com and today in this video I am going to tell you how to give the typewriter effect in your website. Here you can see there is some text and one cursor is blinking. When you refresh the page, you can see it's automatically written. I mean it will look like that someone is typing something. Okay, this is called the typewriter effect. I am telling you now how to do it. I will give all the code and all the details in my video description link. I mean I will update all the files in a Google Drive and from there I will share the link. From there you can just download and practice it. Ok. So let's start the coding. Here I open my favorite code editor. Name it as index.html. Ok. Let's open the file. Ok. Now in between body take a div class and sorry div and class name I am giving as typewriter ok close it and after that in between take another div and class name I am giving as typewriter text text close it type something whatever you want like please like and share this video whatever the text you want you write here ok like that now after that I have to take another file name as style.css ok now in index.html I have to link up it so in between the head session you have to link up it style.css save it now come back to the style.css here what I have to do first of all for the class typewriter here font family whatever you want you can take I'm taking monospace and display should be inline block ok now for the class type data text for that display should be inline block After that, overflow should be hidden. After that, letter spacing I am giving as 3 pixel. After that, animation Animation I am giving as typing and it's a custom effect I'm adding. I'll I may define the property later. So time is five second. I mean in between five second everything should be over. Okay, like that. And step. Sorry. E P S and tips. Sorry, I have to take the first bracket.
steps mean i mean total the length i mean how many squid space how many letter is there so here you can see like that 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 okay so total 34 is there total 34 is there so here I have to specify 34 comma after that comma and next again comma blink this is also a custom I'll define the property later so 0.75 second and step end infinite means it should be blinking infinite time okay after that uh, white space white space I am giving as no warp next uh, font size font size I am taking here around 40 pixel after that uh, font weight font weight I am taking as 700 you can take more or less whatever you want and after that uh, border right I am taking as 4 pixel solid and in orange color box sizing is for actually the cursor uh, sorry it's for that actually it's for the cursor this orange color and this is all for the cursor actually now box sizing border box save it and check how it's look like now okay everything is still now perfect it's looking like that but there is no animation because i doesn't define the property for the animations okay so you can come back to the css let's define the property so add the rect keyframe typing i mean whatever the name you give here you have to just copy and paste it here okay now define the property from with 0% after that come out of that to with will be 100% okay sorry and after that again add the data keyframe blink from comma to border color
transparent and come out after that now at 50 percent border color will be orange sorry o r okay let's say beat and check it's working or not yeah it's perfectly working okay so thanks for seeing this video if you have any doubt you can ask me in comment section if you would really like this video please do like and share this video with your friends and family and please subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon if you want to get the latest update notification to you thank you have a nice day